Welcome back to day 20 of the 31 Days of Horror series. And today we're diving into the original Thai horror film, Shudder, released in 2004. Did you take it yet? Take the damn picture! If you haven't seen this one, you're seriously missing out on one of the creepiest supernatural flicks to come out of Asia in the 2000s. Sure, there's an American remake. Let's talk about the real deal here the foreign gem that set the standard of ghost stories involving cameras and dark secrets. Shudder follows a photographer named Tun and his girlfriend Jane, who accidentally hit a woman with her car one night and decide to flee the scene. But things get super weird when ghostly images start appearing in Tun's photographs. Yeah, not your usual Kodak moments, more like haunted by the dead kind of moments. I made a funny! <laughs> the photos reveal a sinister presence that seems to be connected to the accident. And from there, the tension just keeps ratcheting up. So what makes Shudder stand out from other ghost films? Well, first off, it's that slow-burning horror that doesn't rely on cheap jump scares to get you. The movie knows how to get under your skin, building a sense of dread with every new photograph and every ghostly encounter. It's not about shock value. It's about creating an atmosphere that makes you feel like the ghost is right there with you, just out of sight, waiting to strike. The ghost in Shudder is seriously one of the creepiest in horror history. She's not just some random spirit looking for revenge. There's a deep, dark story behind why she's haunting Tun. And when that twist hits... Damn! The way the film ties everything together, from the ghost's backstory to the shocking conclusion, makes it clear that this just isn't another typical haunting. There's something truly tragic about the ghost's vengeance. And it's one of the reasons this film sticks with you. Let's talk about the use of photography in this film, though. Every time Tun develops a role of film, you're on edge, wondering what kind of messed up ghostly image is going to show up. The film plays on the fear of being watched, of seeing things you didn't notice at the time, and it does it so well. You'll be side-eyeing every photo you take after watching this one. The performances are great too. Tun and Jane bring a lot of depth to their roles, and you really feel the growing terror as the haunting escalates. It's not just about running from the ghosts, it's about the guilt, the secrets, and the consequences of their action. Shudder is more than just a spooky ghost flick. It's an emotional driven horror story with a tight plot and a killer twist that leave you thinking long after the credits roll. If you haven't seen the original, skip the remake and give this one a shot. It's a classic for a reason. Thanks again for watching and be sure to check back tomorrow for the next edition of the 31 Days of Horror series.